Welcome to Draw Studio. Today we're going to learn a simple perspective trick to repeat depth accurately in space. Let's get started. In perspective, when objects are repeated in space, the distance between them appears to get smaller the farther away they get. Repeating the depth of objects moving on the z-axis in space can't simply be measured with a ruler because the amount of convergence is impossible to work out mathematically. But lucky for us, there are a few simple steps to repeat depth accurately in space. We need to start with the depth between two objects that we choose. Draw a horizon line and a single line representing a pole that is the position of the first object. Then place a vanishing point and take the top and bottom of the pole to it. Then draw a second pole as far from the first as you want. You choose this initial distance, but now we can repeat the space between them accurately, accounting for the way they will get incrementally closer together as they move towards the horizon. The next step is to find the center point between the two poles. To do this, we need to use the X trick, where we find the center of any rectangle by drawing a line from corner to corner. Once we have the center point, draw a line through it to the vanishing point. Now draw a line from the top of the first pole through the center of the second pole, and end at the bottom of the perspective line. Where the line you've drawn meets your bottom perspective line would be the position of the third pole, repeating the original depth with the correct amount of convergence. To continue repeating the depth of these poles in space, we repeat the pattern moving forward. We draw a line from the top of the second pole through the center of the third to our perspective line, and that gives us the fourth pole. Then the top of the third pole through the center of the fourth gives us the fifth, and so on all the way down. In each case, the next pole is slightly closer to the previous pole by the exact amount of convergence we need. It is the original depth repeated in space. Notice in this technique, we could have also drawn our lines from the bottom of the pole through the center to the top of our perspective line, and it would have worked out exactly the same. If we want to mirror these same poles on the other side, we simply need to draw lines across on the x-axis to get the first pole, and then take that to the vanishing point. Each pole moving in space simply needs to be transferred over and fit inside the perspective lines on the new side. But what can you use this for? This works for anything that is evenly spaced in your perspective scene. Maybe something like lamp posts, or it could be a fence, parking meters, or anything your imagination can come up with. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to go to drosh.com for more information on these topics and many more. If you want to see more videos like this, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you for the next one.